Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of GTA 5. I've got a couple of things to mention before we get into the video. The first is that I managed to do the Lester assassination mission again with Franklin and I manipulated the stock market with Better Pharmaceuticals and Bilkington with all three characters. Uh, so now we are quite well off on all three characters. It took me a while to figure that out, but I finally done it. So for example, Franklin now has uh, $558,000 and I ended up buying the downtown cab company again with him. And I've been doing like random taxi jobs for just random people and taking jobs, which is so much fun. I love that. I've just been loving it so much and I also spent time last night taking Michael to flight school so he is now quite skilled as a pilot and we are going to swap over to Michael now so yeah we had to do flight school because Trevor said so we've done it oh Michael look at you boy what you doing here oh no he's at his home uh-oh. You know what? This is bad because I don't want to do a mission. I don't want to do a mission here. <laughs> I would like to get dressed before we get put into a mission, please. Oh, there's the mission point. Okay. I think if we go in the house, it'll be fine. I, I mean, I applaud Michael for being chill and relaxed and you know just having a nice day off by the pool but I want him to get dressed family no family no family which is probably good because they don't seem to care for us very much right now daughter's not there Son. Son's not there. However, I do notice that he's got a new TV. How did he get that? How did he get a new TV? I would like to think that Michael bought that for him. Okay, let's get dressed. Come on, Michael. I've been shopping with Michael too, and it's just... It's just wonderful. <laughs> I I love I love shopping for these boys. They just look it just looks so nice. I love it. We'll put him in some nice shorts. Like that. That looks good. Oh, he looks he looks just wonderful, doesn't he? I'm happy with that. Okay. Cool. Um what I would like to do is I would like to go and see our friend Dave from the FIB first before I do this main mission at Michael's house. I know that I'm here already, but I just want to do something else first. Okay guys, Dave from the FIB. Michael himself said that Dave was an okay guy. I, I don't mind Dave. We are now working with Dave for Dave, which, you know, I am okay with as long as it doesn't compromise Michael too much it doesn't put him in too much danger the problem I think is that we're now having to go and meet Dave's boss so I think that's when things are going to start slipping away because Dave and Michael they have known each other for a long time what Michael said last time was that they were working together on that heist 10 years ago in North Yankton. The thing is what Michael said and then what Michael said to Franklin the other day was that it's very hard to drive and talk at the same time about things that is going through my head but I'm, I'll try. The thing that Michael said to Franklin Oh, okay. I'll just do this very quickly because I'm a nice person. Oops. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. 
<laughs> I'm still a nice person. I just crash my car sometimes. It doesn't make me a monster. Where are you? There he goes. You should have listened. Yep, you should have listened. All right, so now we stand. I can return the purse. We've got five hundred dollars from that poor lady that got her wallet taken. By the way, we'll just go take it back, and then I'll continue my story. Hi. I think this is yours. You're my hero. I can't thank you enough. Thank you. Okay, she gave us $50, so that's nice. What I was saying is that Michael and Dave worked together back in North Yankton, but they had a deal, but the deal went wrong. Michael said to Franklin the other day that the wrong person died. I'm pretty sure he was referring to Brad and that the correct person to die, according to Michael and Dave's deal, should have been Trevor right so does that mean that michael had arranged for trevor to die he arranged for dave to wipe out trevor i mean that is huge that is huge and trevor does not know that obviously but that is massive and it's so fascinating to me this this deal so this is where... Ah, uh, okay. Alright, so we're going to go meet Dave and his boss at the FIB. I'm <laughs> nervous. This mission is called The Reese Company. Go to Dave. Alright. Yeah, I can see him. He's in the brown suit. Oh, no. Oh, no. Here we go. Hey, Michael. David. Well, isn't this nice? You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This barn hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. <laughs> oh, 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 duh. I love it. <laughs> I, I gotta remember to write that down. <laughs> and to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andreas, taking notes? This stuff? Whoa. Pure magic. I should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> so. <laughs> well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. Mm -hmm. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stop now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Then why don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up their questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. Huh. My career depends on this. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, mm. that makes it important to you. Now run along, kids. Don't like him. See, there you go, Dave. You can teach an old dog new tricks. Let's go. Don't like him. Don't like you. Don't like you. Dave, 
I don't like them. I don't think the you like them. The Bureau owns a lot out in East LS, Covington Supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet federal ain't on the deed, that's so. Mm -hmm. And we all like our federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. I'm very concerned. <laughs> very concerned, very nervous. But I... We've got to trust this guy. Get out of the way, Carl. Come on, Dave. Tell me, Davey, you expense this ride <laughs> to the taxpayer? <sighs> look out! You guys look out. I need you to make a couple of calls. Get some people on board. First guy is Franklin Clinton. Hey, what? I barely know that kid. He's fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G-men to his aunt's house. Okay. Wow. Okay. Okay. Michael, this ain't the best time. I'm kind of busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. All right, that's cool. I'm in LS anyway. Now, wow. Trevor Phillips. Oh, you're crazy. I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that. So we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Getting Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in, you rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. <laughs> With you, we've got good leverage. Great. And you brought Trevor in. Mm. We're telling him I'm all cozy with the F5B. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. Discreet? Control? Yeah, good luck controlling discreet Trevor. Now, I wonder how controllable and discreet he'll be when he sees the guy who killed me and put Brad in jail. Maybe I'll hang back. <laughs> yeah, that might be a good idea. <laughs> this is not gonna work. I don't know what Trevor is going to do here. Honestly, I don't think that Dave should show his face to Trevor. <laughs> oh, okay. You better keep a low profile. Yeah, yes, I think better. I will. See you later. Who's uh -oh. that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you. Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. <laughs> Franklin. Come on, you better take off. Really? Shit, I'm good. I ain't bailed. Whoa. What, well, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen. If you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. <sighs> like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. <laughs> That's Trevor, yeah, my best right. friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. All right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right. And we do this, and they help us spring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> oh my gosh. The government gimp at last. Eh, yeah, bite me. Let's go. Wow, he looks awesome like that. Alright, let's do this thing. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Oh wow, so we are... We can't shoot change to anyone else right now. Friends are a riot. No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. Sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife, two <laughs> kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For as long as it keeps me 
be amused I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pack. <laughs> Oh, we're going up. Oh, I see. I'm going in on the west side of the tower. Get us in position. I'll drop. Oh, the IAA building. Oh, okay. Okay, so that's where we're going. Uh, up there. Alrighty. Alrighty. Also, uh, yeah, Michael is repelling. Uh, it's down. the west side we need to be on. The west side? What do you mean? going. <laughs> Where are we meant to go here? Um, one moment. I'm confused. You fuck okay. around while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Awesome. I love this. What if we do? Oh, I was gonna actually. Cl I was trying to climb back up. <laughs> I love this. Whoa. It's some people in there. This is so cool. I know that I can go down quicker, but I don't want to. I'm just wanting to look in the windows. <laughs> so far up your ass your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets that's mr k right if we can't do that we can it's in our guidelines i don't know what you're talking about i installed cinema equipment not surveillance grab his other arm no 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 oh, oh, oh this poor guy oh jeez. you think you're impenetrable see how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside Oh, the come lube. on. Actually, fuck the lube. Let's dry dock him. Wow. Yeah, the world thinks you're dead, genius. Soon you'll be wishing you were. Oh, here we go. <laughs> here we go. Oh, Terminate my gosh. Him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me the station, Chief. Oh. 36 oh, my low. God. Ah. We are not going to fire on this He's got support. Uh -oh. Oh wow, this is so amazing! Oops! What the hell is going on? Wait, oh my gosh! Hold on! <gasps> we got a window T! Pull us out! No way! Uh-oh! 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 Uh -oh. Uh -oh. I gotta change back to... Okay. Damn, how do I get up? How do I get up? <laughs> I didn't know what I was meant to be doing in that one. <laughs> okay, we'll try that again. I it told me to switch back to Michael Don't and yet we still have assets. guys everywhere. Alright, well let's try let's do that. No, 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 no. I do seem to get a lot of failures. Clear, I'm team. sorry, guys. Hit the witch! Get us out! This is unacceptable! I'm slipping! Shots are coming from across the street! Don't, don't drop me! Don't, don't drop me! Oh Who do hey, I change what are we to? Hey, no, honestly. Hey! Stooley! I'm not... If I change to Michael, I'm leaving I... here until you shoot those guys! Oh. So get moving on it! We're waiting for Trevor to pull us up. Tired. Okay. <laughs> Don't get angry, Michael. Do something. That's it. Get us out of here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh no. 
Uh-oh. Oh, wow. Got a bogey coming at you, Franklin. Oh, man. Oh, Look at, how am I meant to do that? Can't do it. favorite so far it was just so much fun let's go that was so cool Where are we to go easy on it thank you oh my you saved me hey hey no huh no 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 guy i will get out of this shit In bed with the bureau and a new running buddy. Yeah, he's more of a protege. Yeah, what? You gonna teach him to be old before his time? Yeah, to never grow up. That seems like a good kid. Huh? Michael, uh, look at this, huh? New city, new set of problems, but the idiots, uh, they stay the same. <laughs> yep, I guess. <laughs> All right, Trevor, I'll see you later. Oh, you better believe it, buddy. <laughs> he just takes off in his helicopter. <laughs> Oh man, that was awesome. That was such a great mission. It was epic. That was so, so, so cool. Three's company. I did all right, sort of. <laughs> Not really. Not really. That was absolutely brilliant. So Steve is the guy that we met today and I don't like him I don't like him if I swap to Trevor do we get to is he still flying the helicopter I would say so right yeah he the is FIB Townley, why did it not surprise me <laughs> exactly exactly that is so cool um what about if we swap to Franklin is he gonna say anything about him so brilliant guys look we have so much to do on the map right now we have so much that sometimes it gets a little bit overwhelming because there is so much to do barry i don't even remember a barry 
we have a main mission for Franklin. We have another Lester assassination, which I probably won't do right now. I maybe we'll do that when I have a little bit more money. We have a random to do. As Trevor, we have Cletus, a heist set up, a random uh, B. Who is that? Is that another B for Barry? I don't know who Barry is, guys. I don't remember. And we've just got one little tiny one for Michael. Okay, I'm just going to head back to Michael because there is something that I am confused about. I am a little bit confused. Dave, an email from Dave. Um, all right, let's read this. Keep calm. Listen, I know you're probably irritated by the shall we say favor I just asked of you. I wish I hadn't had to involve you, but my boss has been sniffing around some old cases. I know we had a deal, but this is just a new agreement. I wish it were different, but as I said, you broke out of my protection yourself when you started doing your thing again. I made clear that would be a problem. You ignored me. I will do my best to protect you as a valued friend of my firm, but you're going to have to play ball from Davy. I don't know who you are or what you're talking about. Is this spam? <laughs> I love that. That is awesome. There's just one little thing that I'm confused about right now. Uh, Brad, the other guy from the beginning, we saw that he got shot in that beginning of the heist 10 years ago. What I assume was meant to happen was that Trevor was meant to get shot instead of Brad. But I guess I just thought, like, um, I'm just confused because I don't really know much about him but he has been emailing Trevor from prison and Trevor's been mentioning going to visit Brad and getting Brad out of prison I just sort of had it in my mind that Brad was dead from that shot but he he can't be because Trevor keeps mentioning him and going to get him out of prison I don't know I'm just confused about that I I don't remember Michael talking about him much at all I have got so much green on the map. It's like Christmas. <laughs> what I actually think it would be fun to do would be to get a car and then I want to try something. I would like to try going out on a little hangout with Trevor and um, Don't act like a tough guy. and Franklin. <laughs> Get out of the car, guys. <laughs> Get out. All right. Is anyone else in the car? Okay, cool. I'm going to do it. I want to go out. I want to go out with everyone. How do I do this? How do I do two people? So, Trevor, hang out. Hey, T, it's me. What's going on? Hey, I'm bored. You want to do something? <laughs> uh, genius. Haven't we got work to deal with? <laughs> Whatever you say. Sorry. Oh. I got rejected. <laughs> we got rejected from Trevor. <laughs> hey, Frank. So, you want to keep an old man company? I kind of thought we were supposed to have been doing that other thing, man. <laughs> no worries, man. I'll see you soon. Oh, no. They re just rejected me. <laughs> That's so funny. Okay, whatever. <laughs> whatever. <laughs> I don't care. You can just reject me all you want. <laughs> we'll try and hang out with them some other time, I guess. All right, guys, I am going to go and spend some time with Franklin because we haven't been with Franklin for a little while and we have a mission there right at his house. So I think that'll be lovely to go and do. All right, we're running home. This is our old home, though. We don't live here anymore. Hey, is Lamar here? Now, don't you step foot in this yard. Why? It's half my house. Now, I'm going to call the police. For what? Why? This loyalty, boy. This loyalty, what is you talking about? Don't act like you don't know what it is, homeboy. Yo, you ain't been to the set, ain't came to none of the meetings. Mm, hanging out with old men, ignoring your homies, acting all superior. 
Your mama will turn over in a grave, boy. Mm -hmm. So you giving me a lecture about not being a good enough gangbanger? Gangs is positive. That's all we got, my nigga. That's our heritage. Ain't nothing positive about your crazy ass. Man, where Tanisha at? She got more sense than to hang out with your sorry ass. You know you always been like this, boy. I say left, you say right. I say become a doctor. You say become a patient. I say, who is that? Hello, Missy. Wow, Franklin. You never told me that you had a sister. <laughs> I'm Denise, Franklin's housemate. And aunt, my mother's old dried up ass Shut sister. Shut the fuck up. Yeah, shut the fuck up. <gasps> Here, darling. Why don't you go get yourself something nice, okay? Oh, thank you. <laughs> is, is this seven dollars? Seven dollars? I said something nice, not expensive. You want to be a greedy fucking cow, huh? No. Now get the fuck out of here, all right? You men are all the same. Man, what the fuck you doing here? Here with the boy, the boys. What? I'm fucking new in town. I'm making friends, all right? Now let's party. Look, I had plans on getting some rest until this clown and my aunt came and <laughs> fucked that up. My nigga, I just came over here to holler at you about the little thing. Man, I said I'm tired, dog. What fucking thing? I love things. I'm the king of things. <laughs> I ain't talking to you, homie. Hey, let's go do something about the thing, okay? What thing? I'm talking about the little stretch thing, man. Uh, fucking beautiful. Stretch. Perfect. It's a gangbang. Let's go. Come on. <laughs> Trevor, what are you doing? I'm confused, guys. I'm confused. What is Chop doing back here? We don't live here anymore. We live in like near, in our new house, right? What's this? Like, what's this? What's happening? And how on earth does Trevor know where we live? <laughs> Where's this thing happening? <laughs> Down Grove Street. Oh no. My gosh. We shooting shit up, spraying some other fuckers. I can drive by with the best of them. <laughs> Behave yourself, man. Lamar, what's happening? What you and stress set up? We buying weight, homie. Something that'll move us up the food chain, nigga, for real. Not this real in this town, nigga. Particularly where you and stress concern. Man, this is an investment opportunity. You got to speculate to accumulate. <laughs> First rule of business. Hey, since we're out here banging, either you got some dust. Fool want to get butt naked? <laughs> I'll get whatever it takes me, old boy. Homie's crazy, man. <laughs> so I've heard. Is dust another word for drugs? I don't know. I have no idea. Oh man, okay, this is gonna be fun. This is gonna be a lot of fun. Oh, Trevor, why have you turned up? <laughs> Let me live up here. Hey, look, everybody be cool, man. Lamar about to do his thing, alright? Uh huh. This is gonna end in a massive shootout. Man, We got Chop and Trevor. Hey, be on point, this fool janky. <laughs> Courier service. Packets to collect. You got the grip? Present and accounted Ooh. for. <laughs> you like that, huh? <sighs> Sample. <laughs> now we talking, huh? <laughs> My throat getting numb already. So we good, nigga, right? Well, let's go. How about a taste? No, man, we leaving. I want a taste of the other side of the brick. Now you heard what your boy said, oh. you're leaving. Hey, give me that, give me that back. Whoa. What the fuck? Did we ask? For a key or a fucking ounce? Man, that's motherfucking drywall. Hey, we got some motherfucking buyer's remorse out here. You can't fucking hustle a hustler. <laughs> Thank goodness for Trevor, I gotta say. Oh, he's good. <laughs> oh, Chop, you be careful. Escape from Grove Street. All right, let's go. This is fun. 
I can be Trevor too? This is so cool. I think I'm happy just to be Franklin at the moment. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> oh man, I love it. Oh, Trevor's in trouble. Up on me. He's in trouble. Okay, let's um travel Trevor special ability time. Need a better gun. <laughs> the other one is just a shotgun. Not too good with distance. <laughs> Where's that guy? Get out, please. Come on, Trevor. Come on, man. Let's go. Yeah. I love his special ability. It is pretty good. I wasn't so keen on it at the beginning, but now I understand how to use it. Let's clear out. <laughs> nice. Oh, there's so many of them. <laughs> Nice. Oh! Let's go. Get in. Okay, we're shooting the cops in. <laughs> we're not just leaving. We're shooting these guys. Alright. Oh man. Yes, let's go. Come on. <laughs> Damn, MC Clip! That's the fastest shoot! MC Clip! What? Clip! Wait right there, dog! Hold up, hold up! Peace, peace! <laughs> Get check their ass, homie! That's our way up out of here! Get the sea shark! Oh, Hands nice! We're not gonna. Mind if I borrow these whips, bitch? Hey, they taking Clip shit! <laughs> come on, come on! Damn, this steak in this motherfucker! Shit ain't no river, man. <laughs> Gross. Yeah, in right Look in that oh wow. Well. Can I shoot that guy at the same time? <laughs> Try. Get oh, easy. Oh no. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Shut up. Mm. He didn't know they was playing as the mark. That on they dope. Man, you delude. <laughs> At least you got to meet MC Clip. <laughs> Jack that motherfucker. When I knew that was, no brush with another celebrity. They block too. Hey, we should like race these motherfuckers. We are racing, you idiot. Racing away from the dudes trying to kill us. <laughs> I mean another time. They got sea shark races all over the city. Oh. Helpful as always, homie. <laughs> yes. <laughs> I don't really want to talk about it. Doing races right now, honestly. And keep our hands down. Oh, okay. We ain't gonna lose the cops on these things. Yeah, man. Shit, we need to get the lead. Um, okay. Well, where? Do you suggest anywhere in particular, Franklin? Oh, man. Well, there's no car. There's no car here. Are you joking? Oh, my God. Okay. We moving. Come on. Okay, it? Follow me, all right? I'll get us out of this. Oh yeah, absolutely. Oh my gosh, there's no car. Oh no! Oh no! This is really terrible, bad. We need a ride, dog. Yes. I'm not gonna get it. No, I'm not gonna get in there. <laughs> There's got to be a better way to do that. <laughs> so Let's much flip, fun. And keep our hands down. Okay, so Franklin goes off on his own. We're going with Lamar. But we pull up here, right? Oh, there's got to be. There's got to be a better way. Oh, 
to be a better way. Damn. Wow. Jeez, this is so hard. We just need to get up here and get into one of those cop cars. Then we should be okay. Wow. Get up! Where's my mate? Where's my mate? <laughs> get in! Hey, weird dude! Let's get out of here! <laughs> weird dude! Get, follow me, alright? <laughs> I'll get us out of this! <laughs> Let's get rid of these cops, man! Yeah, I'm trying! I guess the moral of this story is, the hood ain't no joke! <laughs> really? Guys killing each other over drywall? Seemed pretty funny to me! <laughs> well, you got your authentic ghetto experience, homie? Drive-bys, running from the cops, yeah, so they've got it all! You should be a tour guide! <laughs> Ugly ass bitch! Uh-oh. Oh, I gotta get out of here quick before they see me. Man, this is. Oh no! Oh no! Oh gosh! We flying now. Your five bolt catches. We ain't gonna be able to be self defense. I'm stuck. I'm stuck. I couldn't roll over. They aren't catching us. All right, we're getting away or dying trying. <laughs> Probably Let's dying trying, ride, honestly. Homie. Yes, I'm. Right, I'm attempting to. Oh, here comes the helicopter. We're done. <gasps> we made. <laughs> I did not think that we would get out of that. Honestly, <laughs> that was nuts. That was absolutely nuts. <laughs> All right, come on. <laughs> Tell me something. What's that? Why aren't you like head to foot in green with the ballast like head to foot in purple? Mm. Man, that's old school, man. We don't do that shit no more. Oh, oh yeah? So how you know what side someone's on? Man, you just know. Oh. The ballers might wear a purple hat or like a shirt with some purple in it. Or maybe like a hat with a B on it for the baller shit. And you know how we get down the families. We rock the fuse hats with the Fs on it. You know what I'm saying? We rock the green kicks with the green laces. Okay. Man, everybody already know who everybody is. It's just the law to say certain gang insignias make you part of some vast criminal conspiracy or some shit. They just want to hit you with that RICO charge. So, am I like families now? Nah, homie. <laughs> you, you, you just a weird, crazy dude. Aww. Aww. But if it wasn't for Trevor, Lamar, you would have got ripped off. Does he still have the... Does he still have all that money? Thank goodness for Trevor, though. Because they would have got ripped off bad by Stretch. And I cannot believe that he's still doing... Deals with Stretch? Come on, please. You try and kidnap him and then have another deal with him that went wrong. Will they ever learn? I don't think so. This has been so fun. It's such a surprise to see Trevor here. Oh, man. Right here you go, homie. Just drop me here, dog. <laughs> Later on, crazy dude. See ya. <laughs> see ya. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, he's still got his money. That's good. My gosh. That was awesome. Hood Safari. I did terribly. I'm okay at the headshots though. Man, that was so cool. That was really, really, really fun. I've noticed a rampage on the map as Trevor and we are so close to that. Oh, who's this? Who the fuck is this? <laughs> the guy keeping you out of the gas chamber. Townley's on his way. We need to talk face to face. Hmm? Warehouse off Dutch London and Banning. Oh, we can do more than talk, my friend. Oh, okay. 
Hang on, it's telling me to go to Michael. Um, what do I do? Well, I guess I'm not going to do the rampage. I guess we switch to Michael. I'm confused, but excited. What's happening? What's happening? What's going on? Ah, you gotta quit that shit, man. Yeah, I know. I take speed mostly, and look at me. Boom! Best shape of my life. Yeah. Yeah, I could still take you, sugar tits. That's because you're fucking deranged. <laughs> not because you're in good shape. Hey, why don't you stick to doing fucking crunches and feeling bad about yourself, all right, pork chop? Hey, fuck you. You know, I'm beginning to think that's exactly what you want to do. Yeah. Jesus. I just said the same fucking thing to my wife. Did you see his face that last time I popped it? <laughs> Boom! Oh, ladies! God, you're an ass. <laughs> you, you back there. <laughs> I know you, but you? You, I don't know. Yeah, well, until I see reason otherwise, why don't we just keep it that way? Steve, what a pleasure, bro. Oh! He <laughs> reminds me of one of those guys you see advertising pills for middle-aged men that can't get erections. <laughs> hey, Devin Weston is a very good friend of mine, so why don't you watch your tongue? Because let me tell you something, that guy gets more tail than, uh... <laughs> than a tail catcher. <laughs> I have to fucking remember that one. <laughs> you. Where did we meet? <laughs> Nowhere, pal. Yeah, we did. Hey, oh, what are we doing here, mm. huh? This. Please, keep it's that guy this again. Away from me. No, oh, no, no, Ferdinand, he's gone. He's gone. It's okay, I've got some new friends here now. No, this okay. is Michael, and this, this is Trevor. No. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I don't, anything. He's a I don't know TV anything. guy I don't or know. something. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis. Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, high hmm. audio audiovisual. It's top man, good price. VIP. You know? So I believe this guy. Spy. <laughs> I believe him. The asswipes at the agency know this. No. So I need to know. What did you tell them, and what did they tell you? I, I, told, hmm? I told them what I tell you. Uh huh. What? I. Hey. This whoa, whoa, whoa! What is this? The house in Rockwood Hills. The man who owns it. He works at the consulate. Oh, that's all I know. That's it. That's it. That's it. I go. You're gonna make him speak. No, 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 no. You two are gonna drive up to Rockford Hills. No. And when we find out which man is the man with the problem, you put him down. No, 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 Cause no, no, I'm tired of these fucking no, nitwits no, at the agency no. taking all the glory. No. Hey, right, fuck is all this, huh? I think it's a good time, buddy. You know, time. go for a drive. Wait, wait. No. You get to work, and uh, I'm not here. The guy's your neighbor, Caesar's Place, Rockford Hills. What's going on? Like, literally, what is happening here? Why are they torturing that poor guy? I, I believe him. I don't think he's anything what they say. Yeah, the what they think I see he is. Boss, the more I like him. <laughs> if I was you, I wouldn't be so critical of who others associate with. <laughs> so is he gonna be a problem? For sure. But there's nothing we can do about it. If something happened to him right now, I'd be right under a microscope. An electron microscope of bureaucratic shit, and that would make it very difficult to keep old secrets. Oh, well, boo-hoo-hoo-hoo-hoo -hoo -hoo for you. <laughs> you know who else is having trouble keeping secrets, asshole? Me. After you brought Trevor in on this. I only brought him in after you put out your press release. Townley's taking scores again. The Los mm. Santos reboot. If we didn't control the situation and he'd unearth this connection, then what? Then Trevor flips right. out, beheads me, kills my family, or raises them as his own. I don't know which is worse. Anyway, any of that could happen at any time. Slow down. Let's think this through. What does he know? He knows I'm alive. He knows I got money. And now he knows I'm working with the FIB. Does he know how long you've been working with the FIB? How long? 
The fuck does that matter? Either you were working with us before the cash depot job, you walked your crew into an ambush, mm -hmm. one of them spent ten years on the run, and the other landed in a federal penitentiary. Or, or, we stumbled on the cash depot job, Brad went down, you went down, Trevor got away, the FIB cut you a deal on your sickbed, faked your death, and you end up here. Mm -hmm. Who's to say which of those is true? That there's any doubt probably accounts for you being alive. Back there? Trevor made you right away, the second he saw you. Yeah. You remember after the bust, I was in all the papers. I was on the evening news. Mm. The man who killed Michael Townley. Yeah, I was quite a trophy. A good head to hang on your wall. Back then, sure. Not now. I guess that makes a lot of sense. It really depends on how much Trevor knows. And... I don't think he, he definitely does not know everything. He does not know what was actually planned at all. He still thinks that it was all like the witness protection thing, all sort of legit. He has no idea that he was meant to die that day. This is bullshit. This place, Davey, they've been shooting the real of suburbia here the last few weeks. No way that's your guy. Shit. You need anything? You are kidding me. I'll call Steve. Wrong house. This guy isn't our guy. Okay, okay, okay. You sure you don't silence him just to make sure? If we're silencing someone, we're silencing the right someone. Get me another address. That's good, Dave. That's good. Hey, you want a coffee? Can I get you anything? Turns out that was the wrong Azerbaijani. We need a new address from Mr. K. Choose your oh, instrument wow. and go to work on it. Where do we start, eh, buddy? Oh, 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 oh my wait. god. What are you talking about, the wrong guy? No. Who do you want? Just tell me what you want. Huh, man? Huh, please. Look at me, please. Oh, wow. Okay. This is an important part of the great democratic experiment. Um, so I'm just I, I saying. I don't know what this is about. You're not meant to Just tell me what to say. Kill this Mr. guy. K. Oh my you gosh. Got a preference? <laughs> look, look. I know Azerbaijanis, Kyrgyzstanis, Tajikistanis, whatever you want, huh? That's dangerous! You could kill me! <laughs> you can't! Oh no, you, I our goal is not Don't to kill this me. guy. We need to get info. But why Don't am I an it. idiot? I trust this guy. Oh my gosh. Oh man! No, no, no! No, oh. no, 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 no! <laughs> Turn him off! I feel bad! <laughs> oh my gosh! How do I see his heart? So, okay. Oh man, this Not that. fellow! My god! How do we get info from him? Do I just keep going? Don't kill him! Ah! Oh, look at the in his pants! Man! Mr. Phillips! Ask him about Tahir Javan. Why didn't you ask me? I know Tahir. I did his home theater. He lives in Chumash, right in the Western Highway. Oh, that wasn't so tough, was it? Huh? Did you get that? Did you hear him? Lives in Chumash. The Western Highway. He's just a TV Chumash. guy. This is terrible. This You're poor driving. fellow. Remember, terror does not take coffee breaks. <sighs> what a dick. <laughs> <laughs> Look, unless I am totally misled here, I try I believe that guy. He might know people, but he's not a bad guy. I just feel sorry for him. Well, Steve and Trevor getting along? Seems like a productive relationship. You know, like I said, he's got his uses. And as you can see, we're trying to take full advantage of him. Then what? This thing with the agency gets put to rest and we don't need you anymore. Right. And what about Trevor? What about him? I need some resolution, Davey. You let him walk. You said you'd clean the whole thing up back in North Yankton. And you told me it'd be a clean job. No casualties. Mm. There were more eyes on that town than there needed to be. 
Yeah, well, according to my eyes, Trevor's your problem, Dave, as much as he is mine. He's not a problem at all. We're monitoring him. Has he said anything about Brad? Fuck yeah, he has. Plenty. I keep changing the subject. You know, he thinks you might actually commute Brad's sentence when this is all over. That's good. Fine work. We'll send another letter. It's about time anyway. Oh, so that's you who's been sending those fucking letters to Trevor, huh? Yeah. He thinks they're from Brad, who he thinks is locked up in high security and not, well, not six feet under in a grave marked Michael Townley. The trainees write them. It's a good exercise. Yeah, the fuck. How'd that get started? A few years ago, a letter came to the federal prison system addressed to Brad. It wasn't signed, but it gave a P.O. box in Sandy Shores. I played the part of Brad, and we started a correspondence. Yeah, thanks for telling me, Davey. I was doing you a favor. Didn't think you'd want to know he was in the same state. Yeah, so now what? I just sit back and hope he doesn't figure it out? It's worked so far. He's a time bomb, Dave, and you fucking know it. My gosh, this is so... This is time sensitive. Uh, I just, I just have to say that this is so messed up, so messed up. So Brad did die in the beginning. It was meant to be Trevor to get shot, but Brad got shot instead. Uh, Michael got shot too, but he survived. They buried Michael, but in Michael's grave, it's actually Brad's body. Trevor knows none of this. He thinks Brad is still in prison writing emails to Trevor. And Trevor is under the misillusion that when Michael and Trevor are going to work for the FIB, that at the end of it, when they do everything that they've been asking, they will release Brad from prison. This is so bad because A, I fear for Michael. I'm very worried about Michael and Trevor finding out about this. He's going to be furious and he'll probably kill him. And B, I feel sorry for Trevor having the wool pulled over his eyes for so long. Truly, I feel sorry for both of them. My gosh, this is messy. So is this the guy that they're looking for? This'll do. All right. Find out who we're looking for. Yeah, we need a description of the target. Yeah, uh, I'll take care of it. Loosen him up. Oh, no, no, please. I tell what? you what you Loosen want to Loosen him now. up. No, please. Oh, more? Okay. Okay, um, I'm curious about... Oh, I wanted to pick the... How are we gonna know if the intel's good? If it ain't acquired under duress. Like, what does this it's thing so do? Heavy. What's he gonna do with that? I got brittle bones! <laughs> oh, I'm sorry, I'll try and go gently. <laughs> you, you can't! No, 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 no! Watch the Whoa. knee! Hey, 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 hey! Now? Huh? Now? You ready to talk? I've been ready to talk since the day I got kidnapped six weeks That's ago. That's what we were afraid of. No, I mean, so, yeah, 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 talk. this guy we're after, what does he look like? Average build, Come on. average height, middle age. Yeah, yeah, it sounds like you're stalling. This better be hair. enough. Middle age, middle height, middle <laughs> build, whatever. He's dark, <laughs> okay? He's Azerbaijani, for God's sakes. Look around. That enough for you? Wow. Oh, Michael is shaking with that gun. Oh, gosh. Middle We're build, alive. dark see hair. anyone down there who might be in Azerbaijan? That guy? The fuck do I know? You might be in Azerbaijan, for all I know. <laughs> What's one look like? They look eastern. Half this town looks eastern, Davey. No idea. You got to follow the Shah and the collapse of communism to thank for that. Anyone stand out? No, they all kind of blend in. <laughs> Make a call, Dave. We're gonna need some more info on this guy. They're having a party yeah, down Yeah, we there. need more info. I think it could be that guy. Oh, man. <laughs> that ain't gonna cut it, my friend. Oh, Shit, no, so, I, this I, I, poor fellow. <laughs> Oh. Sorry, too late, Trevor. Show her, Contessa. What is one today? Oh, oh no, 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 no. Oh gosh. Um. Look, what's this That's gas can gonna, here, gonna do? This is He's totally gonna save legit. On fire. Not the water. No. Oh, it's water. Oh, I thought it was a gas Don't can. Don't do it. What does this do? Don't do it. Ow! Please don't. 
You shouldn't be legal. He's gonna pour that on his face. He'll um drown. Look at me, I am a genuine government man. <laughs> this poor fellow, my God. Oh, that's awful! It's all in your head, Ferdinand! Don't worry! Let out! You might drown! Help me pick this up! Damn! I'm alive! <laughs> the government so knows what's awful. best for you! Then the government should kill me! Damn. So what have you got for us? This poor hmm? fellow. We need Trev to shake up your memory again? No, 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 please, no, 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 Huh? Yes, yeah, I've seen one. That's almost the case given us. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You know, I'm thinking maybe we ought to just take two bullets and put them in our Please informant help. and just call an airstrike on Chumash Beach. <laughs> I need eyes on that party. Pick up the scope and give me a report. Yep. All right, I've seen a guy Come with a on, with a beard. In. So we've got that Who guy am I there. For? Steve saying beard. What do you got? Anything specific, or is some stubble gonna cut it? Let's That's... start at Mountain Men, and we'll work our way down until someone fits the profile. There's well, a couple there's a of beards. beards at this party. Ooh. Vinewood's full of weak chins. Place is famous for it. Damn. That guy. Beards are in fashion in Chumash. That guy. Land of beach hipsters. We need more. It's not that guy. It's not bushy. Oh man, this poor dude. More. It's gonna be a long day until you give us some intel <laughs> on our target. He's a. He's got beard. We know. He smokes. Smoke. He smokes like a fucking chimney. I don't know. Trev, maybe one more time. Just to be sure. Oh, please, no. Huh? I told you, he, he smokes. That's all I know. Okay. Oh, more. oh, we can do other things. Like, we can Procedure do the same dictates. thing again. He's got to take another round. Um. Be a left hand smoker. Might as well give please. him the entire no, no, works. No, no. I just have the laser. Oh my gosh. His my teeth? teeth? Are what the hell is this? What do we do? Oh no, come on. Oh my god. <laughs> They're all root. They just keep going down. Trevor, like how can you job. do this? Hasn't this man done enough for national oh, security? Dead. Oh, he's dead! Oh my gosh! Here oh no! Goes. Give him adrenaline! Adrenaline! I'm still Damn. here! <laughs> this poor guy. It's disgusting, this poor guy. <laughs> Mr. K. <laughs> Mr. K. I don't know anything, you please. Okay. He chain smokes. And he's left handed. What's that? He chain smokes. And he's left handed. Ah, okay. Come on, that's enough. Come on. Any of these bearded guys at the party smoke cigarettes? Mr. K says he smokes like a pack of two a day. Redwood cigarettes? Thank you, Mr. K. Steve's this is enough. Me it's enough. It's reds. enough. It's enough. It ain't the cigarettes that'll kill him. That guy's right-handed. It's right the guys who put the warnings on the packets you should worry about. That guy's left-handed left smoking. Oh, now I get it. You're telling me to assassinate a guy because he's got facial hair, a cigarette, and he's left-handed. I'm telling you to assassinate a guy because he's a threat to national security. The rest, details. It's that guy. He's got a beard. Ah, I see someone. Yeah. He fits the profile. Yep, fits it all the way. I got a good feeling. About well, as good as you can get while clipping a guy who probably don't deserve it. And now I'm taking a shot. <laughs> you missed. He's on the move. Oh my gosh! We need to take him here. Hit him on the foot. Davy, I got someone. Definitely a lefty. Redwood smoking, bearded, maybe. Could be. <laughs> Used to be. Azerbaijani. Good enough for me. Steve, oh my it's gosh. done. How do we know it's the Ooh, right wrap, guy? Excellent work to the pair of you. Now I got a racquetball uh, game to get uh, to, so Trevor, if you take care of Mr. K, I think we're all set. 
What the fuck do you want me to do with him? I would say he's outlived his use. Oh, wow. We're just going to kill him now? Shut up. That's ah, a sport. What are you going to do with him, Trevor? Please, just let him, let the guy go. Let's go. Come on. Wait a second, me too. Fuck, let's just go, okay? I ain't going to let those G-man fucking scumbags tell me what to do. What? You just tortured me. Don't ask too many fucking questions. Let's go. Get up. Come on. Up the fucking stairs. Trevor, if you let him go, I will love you forever. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Come on. Let's go. All right. I mean, you got a flight to catch. Okay? Let's get you to the airport. He's really going to help him. Oh, safety first. Hey, how's your mouth? It hurts. Can you speak? Kind of. Are you going to hold it together? I want to go home. I want to see my family. No, 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 no. You have no home. You have no family. That shit is over. I do. They're in the morning wood. I love them very much. No, that's your old life. That's over now. You're off the grid. You're one of the invisible people. <laughs> Just take me home. I'm taking you to the airport. You're gonna get on a plane. You're flying a long way from this country and you're gonna spread your message. I don't have a message. You're a torture advocate. Advocate? The media and the government would have us believe that torture is some necessary thing. We needed to get information to assert ourselves. Did we get any information out of you? I would have told you everything. Exactly. Tortures for the torturer or the guy giving the order to the torture you torture for the good times We should all admit that it's useless as a means of getting information I'm feeling lightheaded Sometimes you torture for the torturee But only if they're prepared to pay I am very unwell <laughs> me, 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 me with you Jesus Christ good grief I thought we really bonded but now I'm having my doubts Oh my god, Trevor, please! I love that Trevor is not killing him, but he's just putting him on an airport and sending him away, and this guy is unwell. He's really unwell. Well, at least he gets to live, but in so Departure. much agony. No one drives me to the airport. <laughs> I would. I would. Here we be. I love you. Run. You're free. Oh, oh, what? But my family is here. Your family is probably the ones who got you fucking in here, all right? And look, trust no one, all right? You're alone now. Really? Yeah, really. Now let's go. Fuck off. Come on. Oh my gosh, this poor fellow. Wow. Damn. He doesn't even have any money to get on the plane, though. Hang on. Oh my gosh. I don't even know what I could have. Like, where is he here? I have to look. I don't know where that guy's gone. But he's gone. Oh my gosh, we got a message from Lamar. Hey Loco, you scammy, but you kind of cool. We should chop it sometime. With Franklin or without him, whatever, dog. My goodness. That was terrible. That was terrible. I feel so bad for this poor fellow. <laughs> Truly. <laughs> Poor guy. My gosh, guys. Look, we still have so many things to do on the map. We are incredibly busy. When you look at it, though, even though there's lots of stuff here, there's only really one main thing to do. And that's with Michael and setting up uh, the Merriweather heist. So even though it's busy, 
it's not too bad. It's manageable. There's only a couple of things that we absolutely have to do, but I definitely want to do everything. I just want to see if I can actually hang out with Michael now. This is a yes. voice from your past. How about we roll back the years? <laughs> oh, right now, man? Are we in the middle of shit? Okay. I guess I'll just slash my wrists then. <laughs> well, that's sad. That is really sad because I wanted to go on a hangout. <laughs> oh, maybe we can go in. You know what? We, we haven't hung out. We haven't hung out with Jimmy at all. So maybe we should go and, go and spend later, some Dave. time with our son. A lot later, I hope. All right, guys. Before I finish up, let's see if we can hang out with our family. This big J, a.k.a. J-Dog, a.k.a. Dangerous J, and I should probably say, like, uh, Jimmy DeSanta, in cases in relation to a doctor's appointment or a reservation. Spazik! Oh, nobody wants to hang out with me. I'm feeling neglected. What about our wife? This is my last resort. <laughs> Going out with a wife. <laughs> hey, Amanda, it's me, your husband. So, you want to try to... Reconnect? We can't now. We've both got things to do. Okay. Some other time. You can't say I didn't try, but it didn't work out. It did not work out. All right, guys, that's going to be it for this episode. Unfortunately, nobody wanted to hang out at the end, which is very sad, but at least I tried. This episode was fun and awesome and so revealing with the with what Dave said about Brad and Trevor and that whole conversation if Trevor ever finds out about what really happened which I'm sure he will somehow if Dave blabs or if someone else blabs maybe that uh, other guy that we're working with now Steve I think his name is I don't like it by the way then Trevor is gonna be furious and he may want to he'll probably try he'll probably he'll he'll lose it Trevor will lose it <laughs> and that's not gonna be good that poor fellow at the end that we tortured I felt so sorry for him the poor guy but Trevor not killing him and letting him go just melted my heart in a weird way that Trevor can be so cruel and unhinged and in a way love doing the torture to this guy. I think he got a real kick from it. And then just to gently let him go out into the world. Oh, Trevor, he is hilarious and kind of adorable. In, in a weird way. I don't know if you guys understand that. But that's just how I feel about him. I love it. I love all the characters. They are so wonderful. They are so beautiful in their own way. I just am having the best time with this game. And I'm feeling really positive that we've managed to get through a lot of main missions this week as well. So that is really cool. I know that we have a lot to go. So I'm really glad that we are sort of ramping things up a bit and it's so much fun. All right, guys, that is it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed. I'll see you again soon in the next video. Have a great day. Bye.